How's it going guys? My name is TJP and welcome back to another End of the Show 23 franchise video. So we're doing another one of these can a, world, a player win a World Series by themselves. And you know, we have to do the cover athlete. We have to do the cover athlete. Jazz, Chisholm Jr., we gotta do him uh, in the zero overall league. See if he breaks the game. Uh, see if he can win a World Series by himself. Not gonna go 162 now, we know that. But, you know, we'll, we'll just say, can he, can he do it? Uh, we'll, we'll give him a chance. Uh, but yeah. We're going to get on the gameplay. Before we do, leave a like, subscribe, comment out more videos. We have our socials, play the second channel, main channel, down in the description. If you do let that contact me, TJP. And uh, with that being said, let's get on the gameplay. Here we are. We're in the game. And let's take a look at the roster. Of course, we've got Jazz. Uh, and I mean, on this roster, he's an 88 overall. Uh, so he's the only guy. Everybody else is ones, AK zeros, things of that nature. So it should be interesting stuff. And in case you guys are curious, every single team is th just like that so it's gonna be fun stuff i've turned all the way down the injuries things of that nature so he, he won't be getting hurt he won't be getting hurt but i'm excited to see how jazz does uh we're gonna be staying on the entire time as per usual per tradition for when we do these types of videos uh and yeah we have to do jazz i mean he's on the cover he's on the cover of movie the show 23 i can't not do him right you gotta be able to do him right all right, so let's simulate. Here we go. Sim through date. We're going to just see when they lose. And there you go. First game of the season, they lost. So obviously not going to go 162 now. Now the question is, will he be able to do enough to help his team win? And it looks like so far, yes. Uh, I'm very excited to see what we're going to be seeing out of Jazz uh, in this video. Now, I, I do like doing these videos. I don't know if you guys like them. It seems like maybe you do because people are watching. Uh, you know, sometimes I get the occasional comment here and there about it. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I'm going to keep making the videos. At the end of the day, uh, I, I'm going to post no matter what. I don't care what people say. That's just kind of my opinion. So, uh, we're just going to keep doing what I like to do, and that's all that matters in the end of the day. So... 62 and 30 right now at the All-Star break. Of course, uh, Jazz could beat All-Star, but we don't need to really watch that. Um, we're just going to keep going. Actually, right now, I'm kind of surprised at how good Miami's been playing right now. I feel as though this could be one of our better teams because uh, we're 71 and 33, which is pretty impressive. So I don't know what's happening, but they're doing they're doing really well. So good to see. So maybe Jazz is lighting it up. Maybe the one overall, zero overall players are overperforming uh because we are already at 103 wins which is kind of crazy and we end up with 106 wins 106 and 56 it's pretty good uh definitely one of our better teams for sure if i can remember oh, off the top of my head of course we got league leaders let's take a look at the lineups look at it this way yeah i mean some of the yeah joe randoms are doing well jazz hit 67 home runs had 240 ribbies 407 batting average 519 on base percentage 826 slugging he had 260 hits. That's pretty impressive. Uh, got hit 12 times. That's cool. Not a single error made. 20 point at war. I mean, you guys are going to see some crazy stuff here from Jazz. Is uh, ooh, it's gonna be great stuff. Great stuff indeed. Wow. Every wow. It's kind of funny how some of these Joe Randoms hit better than some of these real, real life players. It, it, it's crazy. But then again, I guess you know, pitching's not that great. Uh, they're all the same though. Regardless, yeah, Jazz. You can see lead in. Home runs, doubles, triples, stolen bases, RBIs, a lot of other categories, which we're going to go over. So, uh, yeah, I mean, two most hits. He didn't have the most bats. He was eighth, though, because he hit third. Doubles, triples, home runs, RBIs, runs, stolen bases, base on balls, on base percentage, slugging, OPS. And, of course, he'll have war when we get over here. So, adding more 20.8. Obviously, he's going to win some awards. So, if we take a look there, he's got the Hank Aaron. Uh, we got NL Rookie of the Year, Joe Random. That's kind of cool. MVP, batting title, and, of course, Triple Crown. Of course, he can have some other ones, and we can take a look at what the other ones he had here. This is the Rookie of the Year right here, Joe Random. Shout out to him. He was actually second in the running. That's crazy. Uh, so yeah, I mean, let's see what we got going on over here. 
Wow, 16 and 4, but a 5.2 DRA. And that's considered Cy Young worthy. Uh, but yeah, Jazz batting title. Uh, no reliever of the year. Rookie of the year, Joe Random. Jazz, Hank Aaron. Joe Random got a gold glove. Nice. Uh, but we're not getting any other gold gloves because not enough people to qualify. Jazz is going to get the Silver Slugger as well to add to his collection of awards. He got a lot of awards. But, I mean, it makes sense because he is the best player in the league. And, uh, oh, yeah, might as well take a look at standings. So, as you can see, we were 106 wins, which was the best in the MLB. We're also 91. So, yeah, we're 15 games better. So let's see how we can perform in the postseason. We've got the Rockies. And I just want to double check where the Rockies. Rockies were an 83 win team. So, assuming our pitching and our hitting stays up to speed, we should be able to beat them. Game one, 11 6 victory. Game two, 12-1 victory. Game three, 17-1 victory, and we're in the NLCS to take on the St. Louis Cardinals. So, I mean, they're there. 88-win team for them. So let's see what ends up happening. So, we got Joe Random versus Joe Random. Game number one is an 8-6 loss. Okay, game two is a 5-2 win. Game three is a 7-6 win. Game four is... It's a 6-5 win, and can we win Game 5 and go to the World Series? We sure can. And we're going to be taking on either the Royals or the Rays. Now, the Royals have the best record in the AL, 91 wins, and that is who exactly who we're going to be taking on here in the World Series. Uh, Joe Random versus Joe Random. Game number one is a 4-2 victory. Game two is a 9-6 victory. Game three is a 6-5 loss. Game four is... Is a 7-3 win. And you know what? I don't usually do these. I don't usually do these, but I'm going to do it. Uh, let's view today's games. And I want to I want to play game. How do I want to do this? Is it uh Yeah, view Okay, view today's games. I think it's what play and then do quick manage. And then what we'll do is we'll see if uh, we could hop on in. Uh, so we'll just uh, keep it going. Let's do it. So I would love to see if this is our chance to clinch. And I think you can, can I think I can hop on into the game. Yeah. So if there is a final out, we will certainly hop on in. Especially if we have the chance to win, we can watch it. Uh, we are up one nothing. So solo home run from Jazz. We got another run four nothing, five nothing, seven nothing, nine nothing. Oh yeah, ten nothing. Ten run inning, right there. So we are definitely gonna hop on in. We'll simulate a half inning. Simulate, simulate. Oh my gosh, we have twenty one runs. We have. T I am a what? What? 46 nothing. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. Wait a second. Game. Okay. 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 Wow. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right here. I am so glad I hopped in. Now, obviously, if I just simulated the game, this wouldn't have happened. So, I don't know what caused that. But that is completely new. To me. All right. Well, let's just uh, see what happens. So, we'll uh, s single, double play. All right. Well, let's enter the game. This is the final, final out right here. Let's see if we can uh, get out of this. Well, it's sixty-four to one now. I think maybe what happened was I, I may have been controlling Kansas City by accident, and I didn't even realize it. That might have been a thing. I don't know. I have absolutely no idea. But that might be why we won 64 to 1. Cuz that's the thing with the with the quick manage is that and and why I don't do it is because of that. And I think uh, well we're going to get it we're going to have a base hit right there. I think that might have messed it up. I still think we were going to win. I don't think we we're going to lose three straight, but yeah, I don't think it should have been 64 1. So I feel like I maybe cheated this one a little bit. But that's mostly because I wanted to hop in and see the, the, the championship celebration. Because uh, we never do that in these videos. So, uh, 
Hey, they're rolling. They're, I'm, shout out to the fans, man. They're down 63 runs, and they're they're still there. They're still there. So, uh, shout out to them for being there. Uh, we'll go to the bottom right. Uh, so that way you guys can just see the board. Not that it really matters, but it looks nice. So, and another base hit. <laughs> okay, are we gonna get out of this inning? I don't. I don't know. I get. We'll find out. I might just. Uh, Come back until once we see we have it out. I might just I might just cut it here, because uh, this is uh, this could take a while. I don't know. Well, we'll see if it, if he doesn't get a, a a pitch here. Let's say, okay, yeah. I think I'm just gonna cut it until it comes in and out. And that's a ground ball, slowly rolled, and it's gonna be a hit. So, we're bases loaded. Okay. We're bases loaded. You know, maybe I'm not going to cut it. I was going to cut it, but then I didn't. I was here. I, I was quiet. I was thinking I was going to cut it, but it just doesn't make any sense. We're just going to keep it rolling. We're keeping the video rolling, guys. I just want to get out of this. Please get out of this. Please get out of this. Please catch that. Oh, my gosh. We It's 64 to 2. It is 64 to 3 now. <laughs> Can we please get out of this? Can we please get out of this? <laughs> oh my gosh, this video has become crazy now. I just wanted to watch the celebration. I <laughs> I wanted to watch the celebration. This maybe wasn't the best idea. <laughs> this maybe wasn't my best idea. So I don't know. I guess we'll see. That's a strike. I mean, we need to strike him out. So... That might be, might be what needs to happen here. And strike two. Can we get out of this and go home? And the pitch is hit. Catch that, please. And he does. And the Marlins win the World Series. And there it is. There's the celebration I wanted to show you guys. Because this is why I wanted to hop on it. Because I wanted to see it. I wanted you guys to experience it. Um, I don't know how we had 64 runs. I, I get I think that might have just been like a byproduct of the, the quick manage. Um, but, hey, we won. So, that's pretty cool. Got the World Series. Um, are they going to hand out the trophy? I don't know. I have no idea. Let's see. Or are they just going to show Joe Random jumping around? Nope, that's it. Okay. Well, the Marlins won the World Series. 64 to 3 in the final game. Um, yeah, I mean, good for the Marlins, I guess. Uh, shout out to them for winning. Uh, let's take a look at the postseason, which I think, yeah, Jazz. This dude hit 623. That's outrageous. That is outrageous. Uh, Jazz World Series MVP. Well, MVP. I mean, 609 of the World Series. Uh, yeah, I mean, the teams were. The team was good, I mean, clearly. Uh, with that being said, uh, let's just go to the full screen and close the video. Alright, guys, well, hope you enjoyed that ending. Uh, definitely different. Uh, leave a like and subscribe if you did. And let me know down in the comments below some more videos. Go to socials, play the second channel, main channel down in the description. If you do like other content from me, TJP. And uh, with that being said, I'm gonna head on out. Take care, everybody. We'll see you soon. Peace.